All right, so right now we're out in Peter Mills, uh, Virginia, doing some off-roading. Since we're in West Virginia, this is like three hours away. We're doing it on a Monday, because if you look at it, there's no cars around. Uh, it's just me today, so I think we have most of, almost all the trails to ourselves for the most part, uh, except for some campers. So right now we're just gonna finish airing down and then we're gonna hit the road on a couple of easy trails first and then we'll move to the more difficult ones. This isn't a lifted Jeep or anything. There is a couple of modifications, but nothing, nothing crazy. Okay. We're just giving it, giving a slow run first. Just testing out. We just aired down, we're at 20 PSI. All right, so the Peter Mills Trail is the yellow one right there, the V. Um, you guys are probably wondering why there's so many Vs around, but V equals V for victory. When people are doing the Jeep wave, they usually do this, or they do this. Um, that, that's that's because I think that's because um, in World War II they were driving the Jeep Willys um, after they won World War II and they were just passing the V the V sign and everyone was celebrating as V for victory. Um, that's the iconic V, if you guys don't know. And yeah, the Peter Mills Peter Mill Run is a yellow, 6.5 miles and just follow the yellow V. It's the only one there's, for OHV trails, there's yellow, orange, white, white. Um, and the yellow one is the longest. And it just shows that we're on the right track. All right, so right now we're reinflating these tires. Um, looks like they've been through a lot today. Uh, the course was half wet, half dry, but we're using the Val Air um, air pressure system. This is good for anything up to, I think, uh, it says like 120 PSI, but maybe even more. But this, this does trick, reflates it less than two minutes. But besides the point, you get that on Amazon if you guys really wanted it. But let me show you guys something else. Check it out. My first badge says, Peter Mills runs, view badge. Yeah, I'm not gonna request it right now, but do it when I get home. Um, damage check. Some of these are scratches, some are not. Um, just know there's a lot of branches. So like this right here, it's gonna need some buffering. 
like this right here, that's a scratch from a branch. But you know, it's a Jeep, it's made to get dirty. Let me check the roof. A couple of tree marks up here. Um, the rim's not super scratched up. It's just dirty. There's, there's a little scratches, but I can't really tell. Um, lots of mud. Yeah, more mud. So far, the bottom looks good for the most part. A couple of scratches. Some, some rocks were big, but overall, the trail wasn't too bad. Um, it is 6.5 miles. It doesn't sound like a lot, but you get, you get tired, trust me. Um, towards the end, I think I was a little over it, but uh, not really. I uh, had to use the bathroom, but overall, not too bad. Just very dirty, um, but honestly, I think this looks good. So yeah, right now we're gonna inflate back our tires. We're gonna head back to West Virginia. We're gonna do a little kayaking or something, and then we're gonna get some dinner. All right, quick update, quick update. It's uh, raining, of course it rains when I want to do a, cook my chicken in a bonfire. Uh, trying to keep what wood we have left dry. And I think my fire is going out. And our fire went out. I guess we're going to sleep hungry tonight. Um, kind of sucks because everything we have, we kind of have to cook outside. Unless we, unless we want to eat noodles again. At least our firewood is somewhat dry, not really. But yeah, we're gonna go to sleep hungry tonight. Try again tomorrow morning. Um, yeah. All of the firewood is wet. We gotta uh, go collect new firewood. Right now, you guys don't even know, but I am starving. Yep, it's hot enough. Hear that sizzle? You guys know I'm starving too. I'm just gonna put it all on. We're gonna cook it all because the weather says it's gonna rain again. All right, so it's perfectly cooked. Look, I marinated it and everything. Oof, it's a little hot. Oh, hot. Yeah, the meat's perfect. But, yeah, I think we're gonna, we're, we're not gonna be living on the road as much now, just cause we're gonna start school again. Things are gonna get a little more hectic, school, work and everything. So, we might put the living on, in the Jeep series on pause for a little bit. But that just means we gotta change up our uh, our lives just a little bit. And I just wanna bring you guys all with me. And I'll, I'll keep you posted. Um, I know a lot of you guys follow me, so yeah, you'll, you'll, you'll see what I'm up to. Oops. I knew she wanted some chicken. Guys, I will see you this time. 
next time for signing off.